Generation Z. You them a born after 2000. You them a born in a the computer age. Who oh, no, knows a fool no life then thief in dirty politician up on both sides of rap with. Somebody got to save Jamaica. Somebody got to save Jamaican people. People like me. I'm going to talk, we can talk, we are go. And some of the people soon get to read our way too. Because when we talk too much, they will find some way to get rid of we, But then they can't get rid of the whole one. Get to the collective head together. Stop killing from one another. God, I go. I'm the rising legend. Represent for Talk Your Mind TV. If you love Talk Your Mind TV, bet me a rest of God, a God. Talk Your Mind TV, anything them say God hear, and anything them do God say, before them even think at him, know what them What go on with diarty viewers and subscribers? One I deal with diarty Jamaican, my deep divers, my reason for a bit. Let me tell you something, me just can't sit through this year. How Jamaica, gold for your mind in a Jamaica, and the people them live like this. How this is how, how this possible? Jamaican people you know, ask yourself, how gold for your mind in a you know, country, I you don't know, benefit nothing from it. The government even come and tell you nothing straight, say, all right, Jamaican, we just discover, say, we we'll find some gold and I saw it go happen, and I saw it go happen. So I put it to Uno to make Uno have an understanding. Say, you know, we find gold now, so things are gonna change. The government informed the, the nation about this gold. We just all just pop out of the blue, say gold are mining in Jamaica. So I ask Andrew Uno, he's been a big man lever. Who own Jamaica? Cause there's no way gold for mine in Jamaica, and the citizens, the citizens them not benefit from it. My viewers and subscribers, that make no sense to you. How gold for mine in your country and the citizens of them now benefit. My viewers and subscribers, and you want to become tell me who own Jamaica. Who this gold about this gold mining and who it a benefit? Hey, I'm a tough fact. Hear what that is. A long time we don't hear him though. I remember you see the views of the people that moment play on Talking Mind TV is not necessarily the views of Talking Mind. So I just put that out there. I don't hear this. From me, man, me tell you something, man. I did tell you already, you know, say Andrew Wallace is a biosexual, you know. I did not point that out to you already, you know. Andrew Wallace is a biosexual, that's why his wife fight against that blogger you uh, where he come out and say he's a homosexual because Andrew was too close to him. So who know what did go on between the two of them? Why you think this man legalized this homosexual thing in a Jamaica? Because him is a part of it. He's not only money. Him is just a part of it. Marcus Garvey say, if you want to know how oppressive black man is, just give him power. And when him get the power, him oppress him own. Him oppress him own. Black man don't understand power. Black man can't angle power. You see, that's why when the white man come, and the man come, and him saying, love black people, black man don't believe him because I were white, the people, but not every white is aggressive against black. Is not every white aggressive against black. You have good white, and you have bad white, just like how you have good black, and you have bad black. You have wicked white, and you have good white. You have wicked black, and you have good black. And your own is trick the people them in so much way. When this man did for sign this Samoa agreement, and the Jamaican people said, no, everybody come out and say, no, no, no. And he pleased them by telling them, say, no, nah, sign it. And months after, the man go behind the Jamaican people and sign it for money. Turn around and sell out Jamaican people them body to Canada. And want to come teach it in a school. I wonder if Andrew Wallace know what I'm doing in Jamaica. You remember when I tell you about the, 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 the body man them where they want to march to Jamaica house. For, for the PMP government legalized body. And all of the pick a stick and 
in a, in a Jamaica, sell out in a, the, the hardware store them, right through the whole island, you couldn't get a pick a stick. Every man stop sell sky juice and bag juice, pack them cart with stone and wait for them half a tree and them have to call off the meeting. Long time, I tell you, Sir Andrew Wallace is a con man. You hear me tell you that long time and Sita come out now. Sita come out now. Everybody a fight Mark Golin. And nobody know the plans where Mark Golin have for Jamaica, which I think him have a good plan. Because the man is truthful. The man is decisive. The man decide that him now make and Jamaica is carry on with all him slackness. I can remember when no bloggers talk, say, Mark Golden can never be a prime minister and him can never lead because he's soft and him this and him that. Silent River run deep, my brother, you ever hear that? When Flatbridge I run quiet, you know, no going at it, you know. It better you go in there when it's rough. Because if you ever put your foot in a flat bridge, when you see it around south, nobody will see you again. You see, Andrew on this? One of the wickedest things Jamaica ever see. You want to tell me, say, a man who was true then, loan, never work in my life, no way yet. More than in the education sector. And becomes prime minister and becomes the richest man he, prime minister in the Caribbean. His wife used to sell carrot, Irish potato, scallion and thyme in a carnation market. And she becomes the third richest woman in a Jamaica. Then you take her and put her as speaker of the house. Why you think that happened? The DPP woman will fight for keep our seat when them find that Andrew only is a rub up money from you know when she bring in a law and clause that it's too late you cannot charge him for it there is no charge for it him cannot him cannot go to prison for it but yet when the young man pay him, 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 when the man di, di, give in in statutory decoration late and I do it proven that him, him give it in. Them still charge him. And it's three years. Going four years now. The Prime Minister don't declare his de statutory decoration. And no one talk about it. No one. The DPP turn a blind eye to it. And now she come and come talk about she fighting back for her seat. That woman may not tell you say. Me across black people, but if you look upon that woman, the people them from America right we call her bulldog in her glasses. You hear me? Them people here from me growing up, may I tell you, me no Labour Party is not for the poor. That's why me I vote for me at 18 and if me no are able to vote for PMP, me no vote. You hear me? I tell you that, I remember a woman in, a, in a my district, when Mavis Gilmore sent her man then go burn down the woman's house because she a secretary for Madame Rose Leon. Burn down the woman's house with her 90 year old grandmother in it. And there's a man live nearby, the only thing he could do is go take out the woman and the woman's house, burn down completely. These are what these people do. They go in every stronghold PMP area and then kill 15 PMP. That's what the harder them get, give to them gunman and police. And them kill people for frighten them for come out, come vote. You hear me tell you? I mean, we never stop tell you 1969 when you share a take with the pound shilling and pence and tell Jamaican people say, we not go want visa for go America, so we're going to use dollars and cents. That when we go there, we learn to use Pound, dollars and cent and take away pound shilling and pence take away 12 pence and give it 10 feet and from that our money now have no use you hear me see I go say Jamaican people look here if you not vote for we 
when I go bite the bullet, me no forgot that. Jamaican people stop the man straight. I remember when Manly put on heat to send Pangas, Jamaica burn down, Jamaica mash up, you have to take it off. I want to know where the revolutionary people them there in Jamaica. But Anja Wallis don't want these youth rise up, you know, because Marcus Gabby said nine miles out of Kingston is good. And man better have a machine sharpen it. Because we're not going to run out of bullet. You don't see this man prepare for war by getting these armored vehicles and tankers from America. That's any time Jamaica can find out what I do with the people in the country. The man come out and him confess to the country already and all. Now him not tell people when do. Why him confess, you know? You hear me I tell you? Them people, you yeah, are wicked people, labor right party, are yeah, the wickedest thing Jamaica ever see. You see, how Andrew only says starve the Jamaican people, them. Eh? After the storm. I tell people, say they must help themselves and do what they can do because they must do assessment. And Joe Wallen is using tactics again. Care, they must drop on the people again by the time people fix up them place. By the time he's ready for release, the money them where he get from every angle. All who can manage to fix up them place, fix up already so he no need for release no money to nobody. Tactics he must use on the people again. Wicked, wicked in plain sight. I don't know this boy uh, takes it in a Jamaica government. Jamaica house, his wife buy it. As the man said, nobody know how much them pay for it, but them own it. So, my viewers and subscribers, I want hear what daddy say. I know what I think in the comment section. Saying, I'm going to make it clear again. The views of the people that I play upon my channel is not necessarily the views of Talking Mind TV. But my diehard viewers and subscribers, my diehard Jamaica, my deep divers, what do you think? Let me know what you think in the comment section. But my viewers and subscribers, this is this how we are though. For the future of Jamaica, for the youth, them can. Them say the youth are the future. And get this youth, get the, if they get the youth them hook up on this grid, there is no future for them. Because more the item for member, you know, the agenda, you know, you own nothing and be happy. Watch this. When time you have this digital currency and a year one, you know, the money and a year one again, you know, when you take up your good, good land and hand it over to this corporation, you know, the form of digital land tiger, the land and a year one again, you know, then you can just evacuate, move up here for the land, you know, some of you was on subscribers. So, when you know, say this, this digital agenda in Jamaica, a part of the program, you own nothing and be happy. Because if the money, if the money become digital and a year one again, when the money is paper and silver, you know, I can't a phone, you, know, you can't see a phone, you, know, you can't take it and put it on the bed. Remember back in the days, you know, used to save money on the bed. And at them come force enough to take out you know, money from hand on the bed and come join up with them corporation. You know, remember? I know they want to take the money, the privilege from Uno, you know, take every privilege from Uno you know, and trick on you know, about digital currency and digital um, documents and digital land tech. These people are mad people. But anyway, I want to know hear what the hell they say and tell me what Uno think and don't keep it to yourself. Hear this, yeah? Generation Z, do them a born after 2000, do them a born in a the computer age. Who knows it's a fool no life, then thief in dirty politician up on both sides of ramp with. Who knows it's a fool no no picnic them future, them boy you yeah, ramp with. Who knows stand there going to go and kill off on one head and a full up a prison and a full up a cemetery. And no get to no collective head together. And say, say well this a future, a fool no. And who knows have to go defend it. People like me are all and dead and we are going. The future will rise ahead of Uno. And Uno have to make certain decisions now, no, and. And Uno have to see to it as them thief in the politician up on both sides and them that we are planned to come. Don't make it things as so it will stay forever. And them people are going to make no say, Uno serious. 
Hey, do not gun them and lock on gun them. Stop the foolishness. Stop kill off on one another. Stop full up the prison. Stop full up the grave. And start thinking consciously. Read some more. Watch some more purposeful documentaries and shows and history. Somebody got to save Jamaica. Somebody got to save Jamaican people. People like me. When we talk, we can talk. We are go. And some of the people soon get to read our way too. Because when we talk too much, they might find some way to get rid of it. But then they can't get rid of it all. Know. Get to the collective head together. Stop killing off one another. Start doing the thing for a reason. Next to have a real purpose for another. Because I tell you, say, no. if you just sit down like say, no. hmm, a trouble there, head man. Hold it for trouble. I wonder if you know hear what the general I say. My viewers and subscribers, Jamaican. This is not politics, you know. Come on and deal with politics. I deal with truths and right. Truths and right, I deal with my revolutionists. Truths and right. And this is not politics. And see if you don't take heed and stick it down, calm it down, and look around and focus on the doom. You don't have to calm it down. You don't have to ease up, you don't have to hold bricks. Just like how them jar bricks found in the lockdown. And hold bricks and no found to discover on a talent. No found to discover the things they wanna on, 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 on good at. And never could have discovered it if you never get the lockdown you never come in for another day. Get some more self time. Seeing remember say no found to become somebody during the lockdown. Because you don't get to find the best on yourself. So I tell you again, you don't need to calm it down and look around and smell the coffee. It's a perilous time. And remember, you don't always hear the sense that your back is against the wall. And some people are going to feel like your physical back is against the wall. And nothing like that, everything that happens spiritually, I know. That is why they want to go on fake money and call it digital. They want chicken in front, plain sight, they want chicken in front. Take on off a eater, take on off a clone, take on off a next, take on off a slave. Because this is slavery. The slavery with them draw a picture and go on a documentary and build a movie about is rubbish. This is slavery. In plain sight. Anyway, I want to hear what I shall live and say and tell me what I think. Hear this. What you want now? I'm an of this, you know, Rasta, to say to my Jamaican people. Let me tell you now. Do not, and I am saying it to one again, do not take any internet that Daryl Valls and Andrew Ones are giving us. Not even hook up on it if it's free. Let me tell you that. Because every freeness comes with a fucking price. You know what I'm saying? And if you hook up on it, you don't have to pay a price. Let me tell you We don't know life. You know, see, we don't know generation, we no picnic, we no grand picnic, we no great grand picnic, we no offspring, right? We no going after pay a, pay a price. We must stop love freeness in Jamaica now. Because Andrew own is taking on for a fucking set of lager head that love on no belly and on no love freeness. So anytime him ready, him do him fucker, we don't know. And then him run, come, come, give this and give me that I want to take you. Yes, my boss. Yes, my boss. Boss, you Who's part of him a boss? Who's part of Andrew when he's a boss? The people them elect him to take care of them welfare and know him a dictate to them and a tell the people them where him a blood do from when he now go do. Eh? Go and do it to your, your family, man. You have, I don't know how much daddy you have, but go and do it to your daddy, your mother, your wife, your brother, your sister, your son them, your daughter. You see me? Yeah, go and do it to them. They are the one that you are in control of, not the Jamaican people. We are not your picnic. Where this blood wine has stepped down. Look how much people of Jamaica is turning against you. And you have something coming to you, Andrew Onis. Because let me tell you, the ancestor them talked to I. And them said to me, say, you are going to get down. They're going to get you out with blood. And them said, you're close associate. Yeah. Is going to take you out. And you have another thing coming. Them said, police and soldier, 
is going to fight against you. And perhaps he's a soldier or a police is going to get take you out and your own is. That's what the ancestor them said. Because enough of them, they are vexed now. The way how you are treating the Jamaican people and how you won't allow them to do their work in justice. You know, see it? Equal rights and justice to have peace in a Jamaica. And it is going to be a war. Jamaica got bloody. Sorry to say it. I might lose my life. My children might lose them life. But Jamaica got bloody. And you are got bloody up too. Well, or Rasta, yeah man, I have a meditation with the ancestor them last night. You know, you know this is what coming to me. And this is what them saying that 2025, it is the year of the restart. Yeah. And them say that um, there is some things coming to them children in a Jamaica in 2025. And if we do not unite ourselves, you yeah, said, yes, and turn the back on this government, we are going back to slavery. And Jamaica is going to be a bloody country. It must be a war. And a lot of people, a lot of them children is going down because what? He said the elite them turn us and our one another. You see me? Yes, so we are going to kill one another. Police and soldiers are going to kill enough. And now we have to kill police and soldier. Yeah. Them is going to, them have to go run. Him said the army, you know, and the force going have to run because the whole Jamaica, when them find out what have become of them, is going to be a revolution. You see me? So, we have to prepare up ourselves. Them said food is going to short. Right? Yeah. Water, them will try to take away from it. Them are poison the water, them are ready. I tell you, you know, when we get in there, they say the water, them are poison and the food, them are poison already. Yeah. And not even the river, them, not going to have much fish in them. Yeah. Because they are let go something in the water, them are night. Yeah. And to kill out the breeder and the fish, them, just like what they are do to them Grand Pickney and Great Grand Pickney. And Jamaica is going to be a terrible, terrible, bloody front. You see me? I don't know Marcus Gavi. See that in a vision because I envision it oh, nearly 100 years ago. You see me? Yeah. And him, him tell it to the people, him, and how we taking it for granted. You see what I say? My Jamaican people, this Prime Minister that we get in Jamaica, them said he are a demon. Them say it's not the Prime Minister that the people him vote in. Yeah. Them say him take a vow and invite a blood demon within him. So no matter we are look for no mercy from Andrew Onis, nor no sympathy, and will come and laugh and skin him teeth, but deep inside is vengeance of blood him want to drink. He's a blood drinker. Yeah, what me dance him? Yeah, him is a blood drinker. That's what the, the, the ancestor them say. Him is a blood drinker. Blessed love. Talk your mind and not half of the press. Big up all of my people in the diaspora where I work. Big up all of who the yard I work to. You see me? But Rasta, I don't tell you, you know, I have a reasoning with the ancestor them last night. Yeah. Close my eye and them in my head and I tell me some things. And you never see smoke without fire, you know, Rasta. Because you want no, the Governor General not strong again, you know. No. You see what I say? When Andrew Onis go and raise all of them, they judge them, the, the high ranking police them, the, the, the lawmaker them, justice minister them, and, you know, and governor general is by Andrew Onis, buy them out. That when he might keep up in fuckery, they won't expose him because he have them in a pocket. That's why I give them raise up here and give them so much money. Because the king, me are telling my ancestor them say, you know, them say the king have stepped down. I don't know where me I get the information from, you know. And something must show about it. Him said the king have stepped down from Jamaica now. He have free up Jamaica and Andrew Wonis know it. So Andrew Wonis make a deal with him that him will be a, a, a queen council. You know, see it. And he must not make the people of Jamaica know that they are free. May I tell you, you know, what if you don't see the governor general silent? 
Yeah. He must uh, sign some, 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 some deals and some document illegally. Mr. Patrick, you win or what your name? The ancestor, them are watching you. They say they're going to make you cripple up on your bed. They're going to make you ask for death and take your own life. Mr. Patrick Allen, that's where you want him. Let me tell you, that's what they said to me last night. You're a cheeky man. Very cheeky, cheeky man. Rasta, the king have given us our freedom. Because the independent wasn't a freedom of us. We were still controlled by the king and queen. And this king now have given up freedom. And you want to know. And him now want to hold us in slavery same way. For the elite them, the big family them in Jamaica. Who enslaved us for a hundred years. When I think it goes, when I see we go on Africa, it is coming to Jamaica too. I don't want to be free. I don't want to live no luxurious life again here. When we'll have to run away like a thief in. So, my viewers and subscribers, I don't hear what Asha 11 was saying. Let me know what you think in the comment section. But it's to the next video. Remember me, I tell you, you know, and some of broke sticking on the ears and I don't hear what I'm going. I want to hear what DJ Kentucky is saying in that one here. And tell me what you think. Because I tell you, you know, but I like when you hear it from some different people. Saying, so I want to hear what DJ Kentucky is saying. And tell me what you think. Because we see it and know what's going on. You know. Hear this. 300 more questions to ask. These people in Jamaica consider themselves to be leaders. Um, in regards to the hurricane. Was the hurricane a direct hit to Jamaica or a miss? If it was a direct hit, obviously means that Jamaica can withstand a, a, a category 5 hurricane. Easy, easy. To the minimal damage we done. If it was not a direct hit, how comes none of the meteorologists never said up to the last minute on the news it says how much Jamaica will get a direct hit? Not even that. You want to tell me, sir? It missed Jamaica by such gigantic chance that only south feel with the end part of the breeze. I want to tell me, none of the meteorologists, none of them never see that. So instead of you know, create a sense of fear over the news, Sell off on the supermarket, XYZ, blah, blah, blah. And if it matters worse, the people in the South, the South are suffering. Based on the fact that we no can go back now and say, boy, it was not direct hit. But create the look of a direct hit by stalling this electricity, telling how much JPS can find workers, very blah, blah, this, that has the comfort. Uh, because you don't want this to cry foul the next time it comes around. And the part where JPS make the local commercial put parade, I ridicule the people on the island. Talking about your assessing and assisting. But at the end, I talk about the people in Jamaica where I live. The TikTok, I can't live without them TikTok. In a JPS commercial, they obviously mean you tell the people in Jamaica the only thing they do with their life, electricity and time, is social media. Now, the same people them with the agenda, they create the problem. Now, remember this, you know, I want a blood clot driver and give the people in my country free Wi Fi. Now you turn and you use it against the people in a commercial. I want to say everything I'm going to do in a country was deliberate. Jamaica, look out on the eye. These people don't love one another at all. Look at the amount of stuff where I got jacked down in the midst of all of this. They're, they're using all of these sentiments to create a sense of agenda. Now you're going to tell me the bread basket is now St. Elizabeth. Not in St. Elizabeth, South, which is that, which is that in a Jamaica, becomes the island Jamaica itself. They were used at notice. Fox News run past every other parish in Jamaica. They never came here with three million men back them to help the people in Minnesota. Not even for a second. When they go over there, take the footage of the people and create for them, can't go back to the mediums if you make millions of them. The people in Minnesota, Manchester, they don't love you none at all. I tell you this every day, they don't love you guys. They want you to you know for bringing them agenda. Because as far as I see, the National Insurance Fund was supposed to support the Caribbean. So Jamaica not fit to even get a, a penny from them because the damage was minimal. So because they create this whole this propaganda 
all the news station them tell Jimmy Gray will have a greater sense of fear with the people them hike up in the economy by buying stuff for them never need. You see what happened now in the long run? Look out on your on your eye and I'm going to love you now. I'm going to ask the Prime Minister this. Where the bag of people where they have the inner the place? With masks on their face and walk on and knock on people's door. I give it a ticket and tell them to stay inside. I give it this to that. Where you not get all of them people and say I'm over South Field and help the people where they want need help right now. Where the soldiers where you send God hate today when you look at the blow. One well, today where you not send the soldiers and police over for back over jumps and you can get back like a restore order. You know what I mean? Where the nurses them we used to have in the hospital and try to tell people the pastors them, the dirty church them and tell people about oh, put the oh, come out, come out, come put the Where they know they are so to help all the people them over there. I will say no more. Look out on a yai. If this was a direct hit, Jamaica, you're ready, you'll be alright. We're good. No more hurricane can't trick you, no can't come for no more news, come tell you about and buckle up again. Go ahead. What do you think, sir? So, my viewers and subscribers, and I hear what DJ Kentucky I say, man, I don't want to think in the comment section, but remember, you know, from the lockdown, or before the lockdown, the movie start, you know, the movie start from before the lockdown. But in the lockdown, the movie pick up on gear, like a series, just come out, just one after the other, one after the other. So, no, no change, man, I said, movie are going now. My viewers and subscribers, if you don't understand how these people operate, you're still asleep. If you don't understand how these people operate, you're still asleep. But me can't come to the door. How can gold and mine in your country and the people are suffer? Remember, gold is our expensive product, you know? And gold and mine in your country, and the citizens even get a briefing. But how this thing ago, 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 ago. And then now they come talk about them are going to go to digital currency and digital ID. Andrew, look your head here, man. How gold for a mine in the country? And you not tell the people, them, the citizens, them, how it go? What happened with this gold mining? Or you not tell the people, them, nothing about that? So who want Jamaica? Who benefit from this gold? The, the, the procedure for this gold? Who benefit this, the, for, for this gold? This gold mining in Jamaica, who are with a benefit? Because obviously, you're not the citizen, you know, so who is a benefit? Jamaican people, you need to ask yourself that. Remember, all of these people in a parliament, we appoint them to parliament. Saying, so who this gold mining a benefit? Who is a benefit? So my viewers and subscribers, we're gonna need answer for all of these questions. Andrew is difficult to answer. And he needs to come declare him asset. He needs to come declare him asset. And stop going around and push up in pictures like in thinking, in righteous, in a righteous. Can can't declare him asset. I'm a matter of fuck yeah, man. And I don't know my motto. God and good road. But we'll clean up Jamaica and get out these parasites. Talk to my TV, or you mean the artist news, artist review, and the baddest TV channel right across the world globe. Watch this the man, talk to my TV, watching the man, they are out of TikTok. Talk to my TV, they are out of Facebook. Talk to my TV, they are out of Instagram. Talk to my TV, out of YouTube. Talk to my TV, all over the globe. Family love, talk to my TV, but we are saying God and God. Don't subscribe to talk to my TV and say God and God. Don't press the like button for talk to my TV and say God and God. I Say God upon them. I want to start share and like. Talk your mind TV. You over there, please subscribe. Yeah, you pretty pretty. Yeah, may I please? May I beg you subscribe? Yes, and you in other city. Yeah, we are beg you like. Yeah, touch the share button.